what do the back-to-back -back wins for your ball club mean? A win's a win. You know, time to make it. Time to make it three. Eight. Are you building something? Do you feel? I wouldn't say building something. I think just going back to what we did. You know, beginning of the year. You know, just bringing the intensity. You know, from the very first pitch. Um, you know, you could just feel a little different energy in the in the dugout. You know, even throughout the at bats. You know, guys, just like I said earlier, guys one through nine working the count. Um, you know, doing everything they can to you know wait it out until you got to pitch a drive. And you know, when you do that against one of the best in the game, you're usually going to get good results. Aaron, how much did you sweet. enjoy the, the back and forth with a, a pitcher like that, trying to think along with him, a pitcher of that caliber? Oh, that's, that's what it's all about. You know, that's you know, one of the reasons why I love this game is the little chess match you get to play with the pitcher and the pitcher and the catcher. And um, I mean, you got a you know future Hall of Famer like that that you get to do that with. It's uh, it's electric. You know, you got the crowd on their feet every you know every pitch. You know, right along with you. So it's uh, it's fun. You know, you now look back on you know moments like that. Every means you to break the home runs route that you had ten games. Home run drought. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. That's news. For you. Oh, that's news to me. You know, I, I, I really don't really worry about that. You know, I was, you know, just happy to barrel something up and you know add to the lead that we already had against you know, like I said, one of the best pitchers in the game. And before the game, Giancarlo was saying that you guys just thinks we're going to turn around. You're going to change their narrative. Do you believe this is a kind of game that can do that? You know, I, I go back to even, you know, the game before, you know, against the Blue Jays, a tough, you know, division opponent uh, with another great pitcher on the mound. And for us to come out with a, you know, scrappy win against them and, you know, they scored, we scored right back. And then you look at this game tonight, you know, they came up with a big two run homer and um, kind of looked like they were going to get back in the game, and maybe do some. And then also we answered back with a couple more runs and, you know, kind of put it away. So I think, you know. This is something to build off of, but you know, can't hang our hat on it. We got to get ready for tomorrow's game because we got another tough one coming up. Now, you think it's special to sweep them after being swept in Queens last month? Uh, it won't mean you know anything different than any other sweep. You know, they're they're a good ball club over there. You know, they took care of business at their house, and um, you know we got to come out here and take care of business tomorrow. Uh, when you have a night like tonight with a sellout crowd, the entire city is watching. How much do you feed off that atmosphere? You personally just enjoy competing in that environment. Oh, it was fun. Like like I said, this is these are the games you like to play. You look forward to it. You know, you always you know look forward to the Subway Series, and you know the fans were bringing it. You know, quite a few Mets fans here tonight, and you know the Yankee fans were, were pretty loud too. But you know, this is it was close to a playoff atmosphere as you can get. So it's uh, you know you like to step up in moments like that. How Domingo threw the ball tonight? Oh, man, Domingo all night. Just uh, I think the most impressive thing is he was working all his pitches, um, you know, especially the off-speed early. You know, off-speed early in the count, in the zone, kind of steal a strike one, strike two, uh, and kind of keep their, you know, lineup, you know, off balance a little bit. That was that was pretty impressive, you know. When you got a guy like that that can throw eight different pitches and he's locating them, um, it's going to end up for a good night. For a group that's confident all the time, that's gone through a tough stretch the last three, four weeks, how much are back-to-back -back games like this needed, not to boost confidence or restore it, but maintain it? Or... Uh, it's, that's tough to describe. You know, it's, you know, our confidence, you know, we never waver, you know, no matter what. Um, now we may get down a little bit after a couple losses, but this team, we got a special group here. We got a special group of individuals that are mentally tough enough to, you know, kind of bounce back after a couple tough series and know, hey, it's a long season and we haven't been playing the type of ball we want to, but, you know, it's time to, you know, get back to what we do and that's what we're able to do tonight.